Hey, it's Richard with Presonus, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to hook up your Series 3 console or rack mixer to a wireless router and remotely control its functions using UC Surface and QMix UC on your iOS or Android device. Now, as you'll see, this process offers an incredible amount of flexibility for you and your musicians on stage. So, let's begin. The first thing we'll do is set up our router. Always refer to your router's manual for details on how to access its settings, name the network, and assign a password. Now you can see here that I've named mine PreSonus Asus Router. Next, we'll connect an Ethernet cable to one of the router's local area network, or LAN ports. The system won't work if you plug the mixer into the router's wide area network, or WAN port. So make sure to plug the cable into one of the LAN ports. Now, let's plug the console into the network. Note that I am using the control port and not the audio network. If you're using a rack mixer, the control port is on the back panel right between the USB and audio network ports, just as it is on the console mixer. Now that we have all of our physical connections done, we're ready to open UC Surface, which will give us complete control over our Studio Live mixer from either a computer, iPad, or Android tablet. You can download the iPad app in the Apple App Store, or you can get the Android tablet app in the Google Play Store. Now for this exercise, I'm gonna go ahead and use an iPad. Now we'll connect the iPad to the same wireless network to which our console is hardwired. Go to Settings, then Wi-Fi, and find PreSonus Asus Router. Once connected, we can launch UC Surface you will see any available mixers that are on the network. Click the mixer with which you want to connect. One of the nicest features of our mixers is that they allow the user to set up permissions for every member of the band, preventing them from accidentally adjusting someone else's mix. As the front of house engineer, you can give yourself FOH permission, meaning you have control over the main mix plus all of the monitor mixes. If you have a console mixer, you can do this directly from the console on the touchscreen or from UC Surface. If you have a rack mixer, you'll need to do this through UC Surface alone. Now I'll show you how to do both ways. First, let's take a look at how to set it up on the console mixer via the touchscreen. From the home screen, click the system icon, then click the permissions icon. The device will show up on the next screen and you can choose to give it access to every parameter shown on that screen. You can also give it FOH control or access to any of the aux mixes. Now, let's look at how to set up permissions using UC Surface from either a laptop or tablet. Click the gear icon on the upper right-hand corner to access device permission. Enter the access code. Here you can see the device in the list of connected devices and we can give it FOH control to have access to the entire board. Now, we're free to walk around the room to adjust the front of house mix. Plus, we can walk on stage and adjust any of the monitor mixes simply by selecting them. PreSonus also offers QMix UC, which is an app that controls only monitor mixes, and it's designed to run on an iPhone, iPod Touch, or Android phone. Now, this is a great way to let a musician control his or her own in-ear monitor mix. Let me show you how that configuration is done. Connect the phone to the mixer's Wi-Fi network. Then launch QMix UC. Now, at this point, we need to give that musician access to an aux send. Just as we did earlier, we can use the touch screen on the console mixer or launch UC Surface from our tablet or computer to give them the correct permissions. Here we are in UC Surface, and we can click the gear icon on the upper right-hand corner to access device permissions. You'll see the musician's phone in the list. If there are more musicians using phones or tablets, just follow this same procedure to give them control over exactly what they need. Or, if it happens to be someone on stage who is adjusting monitors for other band members, we can also give his or her device all AUX's permission. As you can see, wirelessly controlling your Series 3 console or rack mixer is simple and straightforward, and it will give you so much flexibility to control your own mixes while giving others the option to control theirs as well. Hey, thanks so much for using our products, and thanks for watching. See you next time.